Shams One uh, is a 100 megawatt plant owned by Mazdaq. It owns 60%. And uh, we have a Bengoa that owns 20%. And Total that owns another, six, uh, another 20%. The plant has a capacity of uh, 100 megawatt. Uh, located over site uh, with an area of 2.5 kilometer uh, square. Uh, the plant now at the final stage of commissioning and will be ready to, to launch uh, the plant in the next few days. The off-taker of the electricity is Abu Dhabi Water and Electricity Company. So uh, basically we transmit uh, the generated electricity uh, to the national grid. So it's a 100, it's a 100 uh, megawatt plant that can power 20,000 house. This plant now is the biggest uh, solar thermal plant that uses the parabolic trough technology in the world. This is the biggest that is uh, now in operation. This project is registered as a clean development mechanism project in the United Nations, CDM project. And every year we'll be getting uh, uh, around 175,000 of credits that we can trade and get uh, some financial benefits from. So the, 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 to, to give you a picture about how, 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 what is the impact of the emission reduction, uh, it's equivalent to planting around 1.5 million trees or removing around 15,000 cars from the roads of Abu Dhabi. We are, we are working now toward achieving 7% renewable energy targets. So Shams One is the first commercial plant that will contribute to the 7% renewable energy target.